Be happy to... Only quality goods for sale here. What can I interest you in? Good day. What can I interest you in? Goodbye. See anything you like? I offer the finest goods and the lowest prices in all Cyrodiil. It's been... Well met. Let's get to training. I can show you some new things. Good that you want... Good that you want to get... Knowledge is... There is much I can show you. I can repair all... Armor, weapons, I have it all. How may I help you?
Greetings, brother. Greetings. I am Oshiva, mistress of this sanctuary. Lucian has told me all about you. I welcome you to the Dark Brotherhood. You stand now in our sanctuary. May it serve as your new home, a place of comfort and security whenever the need arises. When you're ready for work, go and speak with Vicente Valtieri. He handles all assignments for new family members. But before you go, please accept this gift from your new family. A unique set of armor, lighter than normal leather and black as the void. Now, I've kept you long enough. Vicente is waiting. You'll find him in his quarters. Go now, my child, and may Sithis go with you. Ours is not the only Dark Brotherhood sanctuary. There are others hidden throughout Cyrodiil, each one overseen by a Speaker of the Black Hand. Lucian isn't here very often. His duties with the Black Hand keep him very busy, so he trusts me to keep the sanctuary in order. To employ the services of the Dark Brotherhood, one must perform a ritual to the Night Mother. Only then will she heed their prayers for murder. It is an ancient rite, this black sacrament. All across the Empire, every day, people beseech the Night Mother to take the lives of others. After a person performs the ritual, they are contacted by a speaker. Gold is exchanged, and the details worked out. So it has always been. Those fools in the church and their so-called nine divines. There is no divinity beyond the eternal and terrible rule of our dread father, Sithis. Go now, dear family member, and may the nine father wrap you in the cold and loving Greeting. Take your time. Go now. I've heard so much about you. Why should I welcome to all that sneaking, skulking, my newest brother? My dear Gogran, you are a life taker for the Dark Brotherhood. Our very existence relies on shadow and deception. Do you not value our secrets? Yes, yes, of course I value our secrets, and I've never betrayed them. But using stealth to kill, it's just so weak. But brother, what of the contracts that require subtlety? You must at least strive to earn the bonuses that are offered. Bonuses? <laughs> Useless, I say. Magic are I no substitute for the freedom to slaughter I'll anyone I please, at any time. Oh, Gogren, <laughs> your methods may be crude, but your heart is always in the right place. It is an honor to make your acquaintance. Get away from me. Ah, 
here you are. So good to finally meet you. Warmest greetings to you. I trust you've already spoken with Ochiva. I am Vicente Valtieri. I provide assignments for all new family members. Please do not let my appearance unnerve you. The needs and tenets of the Dark Brotherhood come before my own needs as a vampire. Now, if you're ready to get to work, I can provide you with your first contract. I was stricken with vampirism 300 years ago while on an expedition deep into the ashlands of Vardenfell. For nearly a hundred years I hunted in secret until the Dark Brotherhood found me. Now I have a family that accepts and even values my unique gift. Perhaps in the future, when I feel you have earned the right, I will offer you a chance to become a hunter of the night. Sithis is the darkness of time immemorial. He is no Daedra and dwells not in the realm of oblivion. No, Sithis is something altogether different. When I first joined the family, this sanctuary was controlled by another speaker. Lucien took over when she was killed while fulfilling a contract. The Night Mother speaks to only one member of the Dark Brotherhood, the listener of the Black Hand. And when Our Lady speaks, death follows. This sanctuary has been here since before even I joined the Dark Brotherhood, and that was two hundred years ago. The Count of Skingrad is not all he seems. Let's just say I'm not the only one who enjoys his evenings. A contract is a secret pact one enters into with the Dark Brotherhood. They provide us with gold, and we remove someone from existence. A contract is fulfilled by a skilled assassin such as yourself, who keeps the Dark Brotherhood's end of the bargain. So it has always been. While carrying out a contract, you may have the opportunity to earn a bonus if certain parameters are met. Now, let's begin, shall we? I'm not sure how you feel about pirates, but you've got to kill one. A captain, in fact, on his ship, surrounded by his crew. Interested? Excellent. Here is what you must do. Go to the waterfront district of the Imperial City. There you will find a ship named the Marie Elena. Board the ship and find its captain, Gaston Toussaud. He'll be in his cabin. Eliminate Toussaud in any manner you see fit. The pirates have been moving a lot of cargo on board lately. You may be able to smuggle yourself on board in one of the packing crates. Oh, and one more thing. Get into the habit of asking your fellow family members about any current contract. Their insight may prove invaluable. As a pirate, Gaston Toussaud has certainly spilled his share of blood. Someone wants revenge, and they've hired us to extract it. Uh, please, go on. Spill some blood for me, dear brother. Get away from me. If it isn't the newest member of the family, let's get one thing straight. The tenants prevent me from killing you, but I don't have to like you. I'll sell you equipment, but only because Ochiva is making me. This family doesn't need any outsiders. Bye, Sithis. I don't have all day. Hurry it up. Bye, Sithis. I don't have all day. Hurry it up. You've got yourself a deal, idiot. Now I can sell it for five times its worth.
That's more than I'd usually pay. You drive a hard bargain. Just take your trinkets and go. Away from me, house cat. Uh, look at that fur. What a disgrace. I am honored by your presence. How can Ochiva be of assistance? I see you've accepted the contract from Vicente. Very good. With every life you take, Sithis grows stronger and the Brotherhood flourishes. I killed a pirate once. Of course, the ship was out to sea at the time, somewhere between Vardenfell and Solstheim. Now those were the days. I, I've heard some talk. This past year, some family members have been found murdered. Could there be an assassin among assassins? Go now, dear family.
Telling you, lad, it's bad. Just my eyes playing tricks on me.
What in blazes? You ain't one of me crew. You best start explaining yourself, mate, if you want to get off this ship alive. Ah, what are you, some kind of preacher or something? One of them crazies from the church? I ain't got time for this. Clamour, Captain. Take me down. This ends here. Like a dark gift from the night mother herself. Please, tell me how I can help. So, the pirate has been eliminated. Excellent. 
no one will mourn his passing, and Sithis has been appeased. Please accept this black band as your reward. It is a ring whose powers are quite useful to those who value discretion. You were forced to eliminate Brother, everyone. If I may Even... have a word. Of course. What if... I'm glad you've returned. The contract is waiting, if you're ready. We need you to stage an accident. Kill the target in the manner specified, and you'll receive a considerable bonus. Do you accept this contract? As I expected. Good. The target is a wood elf named Bainlin. You will find him at his home in Bruma. Enter secretly and avoid his manservant, Grom. On the second floor is a secret door leading to a crawl space. Inside are the fastenings of a mounted head that hangs over Bainlin's favorite chair. Loosen those fastenings any night between 8 p.m. and 11 p.m., and the head will surely fall on Bainlin as he relaxes in his chair, as is his custom. If Bainlin is eliminated in any other manner, or if the manservant Grom is killed, you will forfeit the bonus. Now go, and may Sithis be with you. There you are. Welcome, welcome. Hey, I'm Tolgan, herald to Countess Narina Carvain here in Bruma. She requests your company at your earliest convenience. Countess Carvain would prefer if you speak to her in person. She also said to present you with this stipend as a taste of things to come. My lady holds court from eight in the morning until six in the evening each day. That would be the best time to see her. The Countess is in attendance from 8 o'clock in the morning until noon, and then again from 3 o'clock in the afternoon until 8 each day. 
If you wish to seek audience with her, please return at that time. You're also welcome to wait anywhere in the Great Hall. Good day. I'm sorry. You must... I'm sorry. You Good to see you. I heard that you helped the guard close that oblivion gate. Thanks. We were getting worried about that damn thing. Farewell. What can I do for you today? I've got a room and a cheap one at that. You're looking for one? Right then. Head up the stairs. It's the first door on your right. Remember, I didn't say it was clean. I said it was cheap. Good journey to you. Greetings to you.
You're not. Why are you here? Do your worst!
like a dark gift from the Night Mother herself. Please. So, the accident has been staged and Bainlin lies dead. Well done. You have more than earned your reward and bonus. I present to you this dagger. It's an enchanted blade known as Sufferthorn. Its prick is deadly, I assure you. Yes, you are quite an asset to this sanctuary. In fact, I believe you are ready for advancement. I hereby appoint you Slayer. Well done. Now go, child of Sithis. Go and rest. You'll need it. Back for more? It just so happens I have another contract available, one that requires an expert in infiltration. As always, you fail to disappoint me. Your target is a dark elf named Valen Dreth. He thinks he's safe in prison. He is tragically mistaken. A prisoner recently escaped from the prison using a set of secret tunnels connected to the Imperial City's sewer system. It's a perfect way inside. Just outside the Imperial prison is a grating that leads to the sewers. It has recently been tightly locked, but I will provide a key. It should be easy enough to locate Dreth in his small cell. Besides, I think you know the way, hmm? <laughs> Valendreth has been imprisoned for many years. His tongue is sharp, but his body is limp and frail. He will prove an easy, pleasurable kill. You will receive a bonus if you fulfill the contract without killing any of the prison guards. Now go, and may the Night Mother go with you. Stand clear.
course I'm proud to do my duty, but it's a waste of time. What are we guarding? Cold stone and shadow. That's it. I'm not disagreeing. By Ismir's beard, we've Those got ourselves got alive. What they one. wanted. The Emperor is dead. They got no reason to come back. That's exactly what I'm saying. But will the captain listen? No. We must have a presence. The prison must remain secure. Yeah, what a laugh, huh? Just who are we keeping secure? Dreth? Since that other one got away, he's the only one rotting down here. Yeah, well, I guess you can't blame Captain Montrose too much. This is his big career move, after all. Got to impress that lot of... Seven, eight years. We've had a good long run, you and me. I always knew it would end someday. Eleven. Eleven years in this rat-infested hole. But I'm getting out, and you'll still be stuck in here. Yeah! <laughs>
I'm proud. To do my duty. But it's a waste of time. What are we guarding? Cold stone and shadow. That's it. years in this rat infested hole but i'm getting out and you'll still will be stuck in here yeah <laughs> where will you go huh what will you Take it. It's worthless to me anyway. Wait. I, I know you. You, you're the one. The, the day the Emperor was killed. They went through your cell. You lucky bastard. But you came back? Come on. You've got to help me. Let old Valen out of this cell. You've got your freedom. Now give me mine. What do you say, huh? Come on, friend. What? You filthy little maggot. When I get out of here, you're dead. You hear me? Dead! Yeah!
you are like a dark gift from the night mother herself. Tell me how I can help. So, you infiltrated the Imperial prison, eliminated Vale and Dreth, and killed not one guard. Most excellent. In addition to your standard reward, I present to you this bonus. Behold, the scales of pitiless justice. While carried, the scales will magically enhance your strength, intelligence, and agility, but diminish your personality. A powerful tool indeed. I wish to welcome you to this sanctuary, my newest brother. I welcome you to our family and this sanctuary. May you find yourself at home here in the loving embrace of Our Lady, the Night Mother. May you walk always in the shadow of sea. A dark. I have a special contract that needs fulfillment. In truth, I don't wish to offer it to any other family member. I've come to rely on your abilities. We're usually called upon to take a life, but not this time. This contract requires us to stage the assassination of a marked man. Are you ready? You must go to the city of Coral and break into the house of François Mottiere. Inside you will find Mottiere waiting for you. Do not kill him. You see, François Mottiere is a marked man. He owes a considerable sum to the wrong kind of people, so they have sent an enforcer to kill him. Here. You will use this specially poisoned knife to stage Mottiere's death in the enforcer's presence. Otieri himself will provide more details. This is an unusual contract. Motieri had to make a special arrangement with us before it was approved. I trust in your professionalism. The knife I gave you has been coated with a rare poison called Lango wine. You need only cut Motieri once and he will appear to die. The blade has been coated with a rare poison called Langerwine. One drop in a normal human bloodstream will mimic the effects of death immediately. I have provided you with a vial of antidote, which will be used to revive François Mottieri after you successfully stage his death. You should also know that there's only enough Langerwine on the blade for this one contract. After Mottieri is sliced, the knife will be useless. Spill some blood for me, dear brother. 